I just feel like the Lord is putting something on my heart right now to make this video right now as I speak, as I leave my house and come into the car to go get food. Just say how great the Lord really is and how he is the only one that can save you from death. He is the only one that can give you a breakthrough. He's the only way, the truth, and the life salvation victory all in him if it wasn't for jesus christ how would life be now without his sacrifice on that cross for us for our sins that he didn't have to die for but yet he still took the blame for something he never never committed he never committed a crime never committed a sin but that is how much God loves you. God loves the world. He loves his children. But why do we keep falling back into sin? Keep falling back into temptation? I, you know, I don't want to say I do it all the time. But I admit, I fall into temptation a lot because of how God is moving within my life and how the enemy is scared of something that i can't even see and that will happen to you and this is where we got to be strong stand firm on god's grace and fight off temptation if if it's a thought don't worry about it it's okay it's just a thought but don't commit the sin don't keep into the temptation that the enemy is trying to get to you and you'll feel that guilt that you, you're you just going to hate yourself. You can't find to forgive yourself. Trust me, I've been there, done that. I'm sometimes still there. We're all there because we're not perfect. We're never going to be near perfect. He is the only perfect. Remember that. That is why we have this beautiful thing of a loving, forgiving, mighty God. God loves you. He loves all his children. Just do what he has told you to do. The words we got today are the words we live by. Jesus specifically said, trust in the one who he has sent. Jesus is the one that God has sent. God's only son, Jesus Christ. Guys, remember the Bible verse, John 3, 16. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. Thank you, sweet Jesus, man. Live by that. Live by that. Do the will of the Lord. He doesn't ask much of you at all. And we feel like we need to like do something so much more. But no, no, no. The Lord says, listen, pray, seek out to his kingdom. Talk to him privately. Fast. Fast is very important. Do all these things for God. If you love him, just do do it because he loves you all he wants all he wants this is this is all he wants after everything he's done after every single thing that he's done many years ago too and it's what we have today your heart i'll say it again all he wants keyword all he wants your heart that's it give jesus your life Remember, we're not here on earth forever, forever. We're not promised tomorrow. And I'm always going to say that. And I love saying that because this should be an inspiration to get to your knees and repent to the Lord right now. It's never too late. It's never too late to repent to the Lord right now and confess your sins and he shall wash you clean. He'll say, rise up, child, go sin no more. But do my will, do the will of our Father, and you'll have salvation. The enemy is going to continue to come in and try to tempt you to do certain things. But this is where we got to be strong in our minds. 
fight him off. Be like, you know what, Satan? You can't have me. You're not worthy of having me. You are the reason we have this terribleness in this world of temptation, murder, uh, abuse, everything that's sinful. Satan knows that these things can kill you and can lead you into a place that you don't want to be at. I'm telling you guys, hell is a real place. Fear the Lord your God. Fear the Lord your God. Because once when you go, and once when Jesus returns, we don't know when that's going to be. He has full control of your spirit. That's it. You don't. But he loves you so much, and he wants you. Do the will of the Lord. Trust in him. Have your full faith and trust into Jesus Christ. And you will be led into salvation. You will spend your life eternity walking with Jesus Christ up in heaven where the streets are made of gold. And I promise you, it's going to be joy. No more pain, no more suffering. I just wanted to say that, guys, because Jesus is the only way, the truth, and the life. And nobody could go to the Father except through him. So trust Jesus. Trust every word he says. If you're having a hard time with that, you don't even have to open up a Bible. You could listen to audios, listen to worship music, talk to a pastor, talk to somebody that you know that goes to church, somebody that has a good heart, that loves helping people, that that just does good things before the Lord, not just for themselves for the Lord because everybody has a calling from the Lord everybody everybody has something different you know and that's the beauty of God as well because he knows your heart he knows your heart use it don't take what this world has trust me it's not worth it take what God has for you I just want to make that message for you guys Love on Jesus. He's great. He's mighty. He's the only one that's worthy. Lion of Judah. He is inside of you now. His spirit. Call upon the Lord. Welcome him into your home, into your life, into your heart. Because he's there waiting. He's there with open arms, knocking on your door. Just let him in and he'll guide you to salvation. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys get inspired. Like, comment, share, subscribe. See you guys next time.